Starstruck hair is a symbolization of all the hard work that I've put in over the years in this hair industry. I just really think it would be quite interesting for people who don't know me personally to kind of get an idea of me, my business, and what we do here. The Starstruck team consists of Brandon Coney, also known as Share Perfect, the original Share Perfect, and Kennedy Sherrington of Fiction Hair by Chanel, and Tamara Smart, also known as Haitian Baby. I've actually been working with Shardavia for the past four years. We started out at another salon together. I would describe Shardavia as a very creative person that I greatly admire. Um, I look at her as a little sister as well, but a big sister in some ways. Well, the key to networking is this, and it's a lot of people don't understand. The key to networking is always revolving. You have to always create an image for yourself, exactly. and the next image always has to trump the last. Exactly. And a lot of people cannot do that. So a lot of people cannot pull that off. Shardé is she is the best that I've worked with so far. Working with Shardé is an adventure every day. She's spontaneous. She's creative. She's fun. She's the best boss that I've had. Shardavia likes what Shardavia likes. Um, and we all have personalities like that here in this one. So pretty much just it's pretty cool. I have been here, have seen them come, and I have seen them go. Um, I've had some troubling issues that came up early on in my career that could have made me just walk away from the hair industry totally all put together. Um, I have dealt with a lot of backlashing, hating, I've dealt with walking into a salon, all my style of material is missing, down to my tax papers, my 1099 forms, everything missing, I can't even work with a comb, wasn't even left at my station. I've had, uh, I've worked late and had my brand new Mercedes C-Class set on fire, had to basically watch it burn down from me really, and I continued to style my client hair at the time. Um, I've dealt with a lot in the industry that just could have made me say the hell with everything, but it actually made me do what I'm doing right now, being a business owner, seeing, you know, the do's and the don'ts of the game and the industry. It made me stronger, it made me wiser, it made me the person who I am today. We, we don't just fix your hair, we have to actually look at the whole structure, everything in scalp, the hair, the hair spray, the end, the break the Obstacles that I'm currently facing is the events that we have coming up that hopefully we could just all get together and just make sure everything is everything. Like we meet all our deadlines, we um, just be as organized as we can be. The next event we have coming up is Homecoming for Savannah State University. Um, me and my stylist and a couple of our models will be in the parade. That's the only way that you could prosper in any industry or any business that you uh, put yourself in. Um, it's always good to do your research, see what's new, see what's up and coming, and do that. Always put it out there or subscribe to be the first. If you were the first, then everyone after you is second, so it doesn't even matter. I call it my way of staying ahead of the race, just doing things that I know no one's not doing. When someone says about you or when someone tries to sabotage you, no matter how bad they make it out to be, it will never trump the things you do on an everyday basis. Good work ethic, consistency, stuff like that just outweighs all the bad. 
I hope to inspire people by my story, my work ethic. Um, I hope I inspire young women of, from all walks of life to just live your dream. It don't matter who tells you you can't do it or you won't do it, do it. Um, convert the non-believers.